Here's a really cool mental math trick, and I have my friend Mike to help me. Okay, Mike, so grab your phone. And I want you to go on the calculator app. Don't show me your screen. And I want you to cube some double-digit number, like 41 times 41 times 41 or something. Okay. So, so, and then tell me the answer. And, I'll, and then I'll tell you the cube root of it. Okay. So tell you the answer? Yeah, tell, you, tell me what the answer is. 12,167. Okay, so the cube root is 23. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. Nicely done. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to test myself again. So do it one more time. So think of a double-digit number, cube it, and then tell me the result. And I'll tell you the cube root. 74,088. 42. Yep. Awesome. It's yeah. the meaning of life. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Do you want to know how I did that? Well, we have 10 cubed, 20 cubed, all the way to 90 cubed. And 1 cubed to 9 cubed is really cool because they each have a unique ones digit. So when Mike said 12,167, I know that it's between 20 cubed and 30 cubed. So it has to be 20 something. And the last digit was a 7. And that corresponds to the 3 cubed. So I know that it was 23 cubed. Okay, Mike, so let's challenge our audience. Can you cube some double-digit number, give the answer, and then they will uh, determine what the cube root is? All right, so the cubed is 681,472. All right, take a couple seconds. What's the cube root? All right, so it is between 512,000 and 729,000, so it's 80-something. And then the last digit is a 2, so that corresponds to 8 cubed. So the answer is 88. Now, I know what you're thinking. That's a lot to memorize. And yes, you do have to memorize 10 cubed, 20 cubed, all the way to 90 cubed. But let's take a look at the 1's digit. 1, 4, 5, 6, and 9 are all assigned to themselves. And 2 and 8 are switched, and 3 and 7 are switched. 